So I bought the cheapest hot water pressure washer uh, from Ritchie Brothers Auction in Vancouver. Now it had flat tires on it. Didn't know if it would run or not. And uh, brought it home. Went to fire it up and the carburetor was leaking gas. So I put another carburetor on it. Had one kicking around. It fit on it. Then I had to drain the oil because there was gas in the oil. Um, runs on diesel. Diesel, and it had diesel in it. So uh, got it fired up. Uh, tires are all holding air. And this is the gauge here to turn up and down. I believe this is the indicator right there. Um, when I first fired it up, it uh, blew a lot of smoke out here, so I'm imagining there's a little bit of diesel or oil or something on the coils in there. Nice big hose, nice wand. Good size engine too. There's the pressure, increase, decrease. There's your inlet. Um, the uh, cold water goes up into there, heats up, and then comes back out so it doesn't actually put hot water through the pump. There's uh, the oil that goes into the pump there. So yeah, so it's a good little unit. So uh, I'll show it here running, and uh, I got a trailer here I gotta wash up. So. Cut the bugs off the front with that hot water. It's really good.
I gotta say, that works pretty good for being the cheapest uh, pressure washer at the auction. You know, it's got a few little flaws, but it works really well. Definitely hot. Oof. Yeah, I got her set at about 90. I'm a little nervous to go too high. I think it goes up to 150s. It didn't seem to suck soap, so I'm gonna guess that unless somebody knows they can put in the comments, I think that uh, you probably have to set it at a lower setting for soap. But if anybody knows that, please uh, put that in the comments. But yeah, good little unit. I got the trailer nice and clean. And got my door nice and clean for the garage. Yeah, did a nice job. I'm amazed at the bugs on the front though, too, like how it got the bugs off. You know, normally you gotta scrub them and scrub them with, even with a regular pressure washer. But that got them off really well. So I know these, I believe these go for around 5,000 new. You can get them used for 2,500. Uh, at auction, I paid roughly eleven $1 hundred dollars. Uh, I was taking a gamble, though. You know, the tires were flat; it was strapped to this pallet, and I had no way of testing it. And the carburetor leaked as I, when I got it home. So, but I got another carburetor. You can get them online for like eleven dollars. So, a new carburetor, put some fresh oil in it. I already had full of diesel. Um, probably not the best diesel. So, once I get it run out, I'll put some fresh diesel in it. But uh, it just gets hooked up to 110 volt. And away she goes. So, yeah, if uh, anybody can comment on that soap dispenser, I'd love to know that. But otherwise, uh, please hit like down below and please subscribe to my videos. I got more coming. And uh, ciao for now, guys.